Welcome back from the commercial break, and please join me in welcoming our second guest, Marianne Wright Elman. Welcome! Hi. So nice to have Thanks you here. Nice. So why don't we jump right into it? Let us know. Tell us a little bit about yourself. Well, I was born in 1939 in Bennettsville, South Carolina. Mm -hmm. I attended Spelman College and later Yale Law School. I started working with Dr. Martin Luther King. Uh, we advocated for poor families that were sharecropping and had little to no food. So we filed lawsuits on their behalf. I um, focused my efforts towards the children after Dr. King's assassination. So I uh, founded the Children's Defense Fund, and that's what I'm here to talk to you about today. Well, tell us a little bit more about the Children's Defense Fund. Well, it's an advocacy and research foundation for disabled youth and um, minorities, uh, disabled, disadvantaged youth. And we advocate uh, pre pregnancy prevention and prenatal care for those that we miss with the pregnancy prevention and child care funding and a lot more. Wonderful. So uh, we all know there's a lot of issues and discussions going on in the government right now. What would you say is the biggest issue facing America today? Well, I think it's the failure of the nation to invest in our children. Um, the, there's a lot of children that can't read, write, or compute at grade level, and they're our next generation. They're going to be our workforce. So I think that's the nation's biggest failure right now. I, I agree completely. So what would you say is your most prized award? Well, I believe that that would be the 2000 Presidential Medal of Freedom that I received from Bill Clinton, President Bill Clinton, for the accomplishments of the Children's Defense Fund. Wonderful. It was so great having you here. Great meeting you. Yeah. And we'll be back after this short commercial break with our next guest. Yeah. 